Hello everybody, this is Mrs Gilbert. Welcome to Maths for Tuesday the 19th of January. So the short date today is 19-1-21. And today we are learning to subtract a one-digit number from a two-digit number. So you did that yesterday, but today we're going to be using the part part whole model. So let's have a look at that on the back of my board. Ta -da, there's a part part whole model. Now when we've used these before for adding, we've added the two parts to make the whole. So we would have had added 7 add 5 to make 12. Or the switcher, 5 add 7 to make 12. Now the difference is with a takeaway or a subtraction, remember the sign for subtract or take away looks like that. The difference is we always have to start with the whole. We can't start with a part and take away a bigger number. We've always got to start with the greatest number, which is the whole. Oops. You will be able to tell which number is the whole, won't you? Because remember, all roads lead to the whole. So that's got all the roads going up to it. So our whole is 12 today. So I'm going to start with 12. I'm going to write this subtraction sentence on my board, starting with 12. Can you see that? Not very well, move it round. And then I'm going to take away one of the parts. Which one shall I choose? I'll choose five. So I'm going to do 12, take away five. Hmm. Now, what do you think I'm going to be left with? 12, take away five. What do you think I'm going to be left with? Do you think seven? Okay, let's check on our number line. There's a number track here. So I'm going to start at 12 and I'm going to jump back five. Remember, we're going down towards the smaller numbers because we're taking away. So 12, I'm going to jump back five, not counting the number I'm on. One, two, three, four, five. Did you expect me to land on seven? You should have done, because 12 take away 5 is 7. That's our part whole model, isn't it? Okay, so I'm going to put 7 in there. Now, I said we can't do a switcher like you can with addition by swapping these numbers around, but you can swap these numbers around. So this time I'm going to do 12 take away 7. What do you think I'm going to be left with? Hmm? Do you think 5? Okay, let me write it down. So I'm going to write down 12, take away 7, equals, okay, and then I'm going to try it on the number track to check that it makes 5. Are you ready then? So I'm going to start at 12. I'm going to jump back 7. Not count the number that I'm on. <clears throat> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Did you expect me to land on five? Yeah, because 12 take away seven equals five. So although the switcher looks different, there is still a switcher, it's just different to the addition one. So 12 take away five equals seven. 12 take away seven equals five. 12 take away five equals seven. 12 take away 7 equals 5. Now the problem I anticipate you having today is that you won't always start with the biggest number. You might need to be reminded about that every time you need to start with the biggest number. So I've made some for you to have a go at. So you will need to pause the video to have a go at these. So we've got the whole and the parts. Remember, it can go in any direction. So this time, on this one, the whole is there at the bottom and there are the two parts. On this one, 
all roads lead to the whole. The whole is in, on the right over here and the two parts are on the left. And in this one, the whole is at the top. So pause the video and have a go. And then when you're ready, come back if you would like an extra challenge. Bye for now. Hello everybody again. Did you come back for the extra challenge? Well done you. Now your extra treat for the extra challenge is um, to first of all admire my brand new nails that I got especially for you. Can you guess the theme? I'll give you a clue that little one on the end. Can't Maybe can't see it very well. It says Andy on it. Mm, does that give you any clues? Andy, oh, there's a little alien one, look, with three eyes. Mm, does anyone recognise it? Have you guessed? That's right, I've got Toy Story nails, especially for you, aren't you lucky? So, thank you for coming back for the extra challenge today. Here it is. So, your extra challenge is... And you don't just have to do two, you can do some more. If you've got a grown up with you, they could perhaps write some more for you. Your extra challenge is we've got the whole here, but no parts. Now, what could those two parts be to make the whole? Mm, have a little think. There are lots of ways that you can make um, that whole. It's not just one way. So lots and lots and lots of ways so if you're really 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 got your maths brain switched on today you might see how many ways you can find to make the whole so we've got two of those for you to do this morning okay you can uh, stop now and i'll see you later thanks for coming bye for now <laughs>